Let's do some pretty stuff with you, huh? Not, not difficult. That's what we'll do. So we are back. I'm back here with Autumn. How are you feeling after our bar exercises? Strong. Very good. You look strong. You look strong. So, um, yeah, how have you liked the workshop so far? What do you think of the workshop? I loved it, honestly. I think even though it, you know, it's for beginners and you can tell that it's for beginners, it's really good for the basics. Like if you haven't been in dance for a long time and you kind of need that refresher, I, I mean, I've been loving it, so. Thank you, I'm glad to hear that. We're very specific about what we do. So we have uh, multiple other teachers. Do you remember the name of you? What night are you teaching, what Wednesday. taking? Wednesday, yeah, that's Alexandra. Alexandra is a beautiful dancer. And you can see some video work of me on YouTube with Alexandra Pullen, who was a dancer for four years with American Ballet Theater. She's the real deal. So um, she's one of our instructors. She does an amazing job. And yeah, so a lot of people, a lot of people don't understand we really are for beginners. We are real beginning ballet. So, um, and then our basic is still, a, like a dancer like her should start in basic or yeah, probably if you're coming back, someone at this skill level can go right into our basic classes. So, but we're gonna put you in the intermediate because you're gonna be fun. Um, so we're gonna do right now, after we got that all out of the way, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a very simple fondue pas de bray exercise into a chasse and tendu. And I like working on this very simple material because we can work on the quality of movement and the, artist, the artistic quality of this movement. Let's scoot, scoot a little bit more forward. So actually, and let's trade sides because I'm gonna start on this side. Yeah, I'm gonna start over here. We're gonna be in fifth position. We're gonna prepare the arms into second five, six, seven, eight. As we go into the fondu, we're gonna bring this arm down and through the center and over. Yeah, we're gonna fondue the back leg. So let's just try this. I'll demonstrate for us, watch how I do this. You look into the palm of the hand at the bottom of the motion, so we go. Even when I say look, I mean really look. Yes. Oh, that's so beautiful. Look at that line. You just do that again. The subtle details are what make ballet exquisite. Yeah. Yes. Good. Exactly. That's it. Good. So we could do that on one, two. We go five, six, seven, eight. this en bas position. Just open the shoulders a little, yes, a little bit more. We're gonna go into a deep demi plie. We're gonna push off that buck foot and chasse de tendu quasi derriere. Bringing the yeah, same arm as leg forward. Beautiful line and close. Then we'll do that on the other side. Down stage arm comes up. Yes, lifting the back foot, good. Pas de beret, da, da, da. Close, plie, chasse to the quasi tendu arabesque. Yes, excellent. Looking over the hand and close. Very nice. Now, I got so lucky today <laughs> working with this wonderful student of mine. So fortunate, right? Yes. All the people I've worked with have been great, like they've been, but they've been total beginners, really. So, um, so yeah, let's try. I'll do the first set with you. We'll do right, left, right, left.
deixar, Senhor. Very good, very good, yeah. So you actually struggled at the point that I thought you would struggle at. And this is really actually very difficult to do well, to melt into this fondue and bring this arm up over your head and maintain your balance. One and two. Let's see how solid that is. Very good. Yeah, very good. Rest. Kids at home, that's not easy to do. That is not easy to do well. That's what really separates the men from the boys in ballet class. I really think, like, when you see dancers who can do that well, you know they have some pretty solid technique behind them. I feel like on YouTube, everybody wants turn tutorials and split jeté tutorials. If you make it look effortless. I'm sorry? If you make it look effortless, then you know it's hard. We are right now working on the quality of her movement, the precision, the balance, and you actually need much more of these fundamentals. You're never going to have great turns and great jumps and great landings without these, these ideas we're about to work on here, which is maintaining your balance on this column. So I can combre my body, but I'm really driving into the fl floor and my back is stabilized. So I don't allow my back to go forward. I also don't allow this arm to affect my back. This arm comes down in this plane, it comes up through, and I just turn my head. And that takes a great amount of skill. Let's, so let's watch her do it one more time, everybody. Let's just try, let's see what happens. Good, that was nice. Can you go a little lower into the fondue? Down into the floor, deep into the plie. Very good, yes. Not easy, good, nah, yeah. I hope you guys are trying this at home. I hope she's not the only one who's suffering over here. Good.